Hello and welcome to another installment of the Screaming Success Vocal Academy. I'm your professor, Mike She, singer for the band Invicta, Nashville, Tennessee, also part of the Nashville Singers. We do jazz, blues, acapella, classical, all sorts of fun stuff. We are here at uh, Sick Island Studios, that is uh, Invicta's home base here in Nashville, Tennessee. If you're budding musicians out there, you need a place to do your next album, need some demos tracked, I strongly recommend hitting them up. But today, we're going to be talking about a singer that many, many people wish to emulate, that is James Hetfield. You know, he's got a very distinctive voice. I get all the time uh, questions like, how do I sing like him? How do I get the grit in his voice like him? And uh, today, I hopefully, we'll be able to answer a couple of those questions for you. Now, first things first, you've got the grit in his voice. How do you get that grit? Now, I know a lot of people just think that's the way he sings. Maybe he damaged his voice with cigarettes or something. Well, not really. I mean, maybe he did, but not really. It's a technique that you can apply to your existing voice. It's not so much like learning, you know, a, a guitar or like a piano. You gotta work on your dexterity and get all this theory. It's more of like a light switch. Like you figure out where the place in your throat that it's coming from is and then all you really need to do is get better at feeling where that light switch is to click it on and off. More of like a dimmer, you know? I'm taking this metaphor really far. He's using his false chords. Your false chords are also called your vestibular folds. They're these flaps of uh, skin or muscle or I don't know, I think skin. <laughs> Just sit on top of your vocal cords. But they're much thicker than your normal vocal cords, especially with people with very deep voices like mine. So they're very robust and when you make them vibrate, they make very distinctive sounds like this. Oh, those are your false chords. And I talk about these in a lot of my different videos. And you can seamlessly kind of go in and out of them because you're still using your normal vocal cords for some of the pitch. Uh, and that's what James does. You've probably heard it in like, hey, hey, hey. When I go now, or whatever the words are there. That's my go-to example. You'll probably hear it in a couple other videos too. You're like, hey, that is, that's how you do it. Well, how do I figure out how to do that? Well, it's pretty easy. I've got another video right here called Learning to Throat Sing that'll teach you how to do it. Or the quick way, so you kind of think of like clearing your throat like a uh, 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 or a heavy sigh like a uh, uh. and you might hear like kind of that Batman-esque, you know, Christian Bale is Batman. Same thing, you've got this kind of like floppy, kind of, you'll feel it wobbling around in there. Uh, uh, uh. Well then the trick is, uh, isolate that and then get it to where you can just do it on a pitch, like uh, uh, uh. And if you're a girl, it might be up higher, like uh, somewhere up there um, but so that's how you do that and then as you practice that you can work on getting it up into the higher pitches and that is where James Hetfield's grit comes from uh, he also enunciates a lot and he uh, places a lot of emphasis on the last syllables of his words so you know like Exilita! you don't have to do that in fact I'd recommend you not do that because that's like his shtick and so if you do it everybody will assume you got it from James. Those are really the two things, two components to singing like James Hetfield. And the road becomes my bride. And the road becomes my bride. I am stripped of all my pride. So in her I do confide. And she keeps me satisfied. Gives me all I need. So there you go. You've learned how to sing like James Hetfield. Uh, be sure to subscribe. Going to be making a lot more of these videos. If there's a singer you desperately want to know how to sing like, please let me know. I'll try to make a new video for you. Uh, also, check out my band's page. I've got several other more general tutorials on uh, various vocal effects and vocal techniques. Uh, that's over here at youtube.com slash Invicta Music. So uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys. And... Uh, until next time, stay metal. Also, if you've enjoyed your lesson today but you got some additional questions, feel free to leave some comments down below. I'll try to uh, answer them if I can. 
The best thing to do would be to go to my profile that's linked in the video description at bandhappy.com. I do give one-on-one -on -one video lessons. Uh, all the information is posted there and uh, it's really helpful. So uh, that's a great way to follow up on this and uh, otherwise just subscribe and you'll get all sorts of other great tips. Take care guys. Bye-bye.